Okay. Which of the following target organs is most susceptible to damage as a result of hypertension? And so it lists a few of our organs. And then we have a 64 year old woman with a history of type two diabetes and hyperlipidemia diagnosed with primary hypertension. Her blood pressure is consistently 150 over 90 during multiple visits. So let's see. I wanna say the kidneys. The kidneys are pretty responsive to changes in blood pressure. Yeah, so uh, if I were to pick an answer, that's what I would pick also. As we know, the, the kidney is a heavy regulator of blood pressure, of course, and as your blood pressure gets too high, you know, you have your uh, arterioles and whatnot of your kidneys are gonna get thicker and thicker, so they're gonna respond, right? Of course, right? Um, you know, we haven't submitted the answer, so I don't know if we're right or wrong, but looking at the other answers, just know that every organ gets affected by high blood yes. pressure, right? They're just saying what's most susceptible, so. Yeah, I think that's why it's kind of tricky, <laughs> like everything <Yep>. is. <laughs> yep, so good, kidneys, right? And so, um, so let's read the explanation here, right? Hypertension is a major risk factor for developing a chronic kidney disease and in-stage kidney disease, right? Which kind of what we talk about, right? So if the the arteries, right, kind of um, kind of get more and more thick, right? And then you have kidney damage, right? Because less blood supply, et cetera, et cetera, right? Um, so yeah, it makes sense. But just on a side note, right? All organs get um, get a little bit damaged, of course, um, in their yeah. own ways. But when we really talk about hypertension, things like that, um, what, what is the other organ that gets affected quite heavily also with hypertension? Um, like from the list or in general? Nope, out of the, uh, that's not on this list. That's not listed? That'd be your heart. Yeah, bingo, right? Um, your heart and your kidneys um, play a lot mm -hmm. with fluid dynamics and fluid uh, homeostasis in your body and in particular salt control, right? And so um, when you have high blood pressure, your your heart has to push quite heavily against um, mm -hmm. higher systemic resistance. And then you can have remodeling of your heart, like left ventricular hypertrophy, right? And so yes. um, if they had the heart on here, I'd say it'd be a poor question, right? But luckily, yeah. <laughs> right? so good.